Hello everybody, it's Russ. Are you looking for a great metal detector under $100? Well, you're in luck, because in this video, I'm gonna talk about a great American-made metal detector that's under $100. Welcome back everybody. Now it's time to introduce the star of the show, which would be the Mach 1 metal detector from Bounty Hunter Metal Detectors. At the time of this filming, this unit is selling for $75. I'll put a link down below so you can check the current price. The Mach 1 comes with a one year warranty and is manufactured by American made company, Bounty Hunter Metal Detectors in El Paso, Texas. Speaking of American, the shirt I'm wearing right now is called American Detection. If you'd like to get yours, I'll put a link to it down below. For a detector under $100, the Mach 1 has a ton of high dollar features. The first is Digital Target ID. Now let's talk about Digital Target ID. The Mach 1 will tell you what the target likely is through Target ID categories. Each Target ID category represents a different type of metal makeup. All right, so the first target is gonna be an iron or ferrous screw. You'll notice that FE popped up, the first category, and we have that low tone. All right, so now we're going to do a U.S. nickel. You'll notice you had that mid-tone, and the number three category lit up. All right, the next target will be a silver quarter. You'll notice on that silver quarter, the number four category lit up and we had a high tone. Beyond identifying targets, the Mach 1 can also reject targets that you don't want to detect. Now coupled with target ID is discrimination. Let's say we don't want to dig those iron nails, but we don't even want to hear them. We hit the discrimination and you see that first category disappeared. Now watch what happens when we detect that iron or ferrous screw again. It's gone. Let's bring that back in. We'll go all the way through. So we've got it back in now. Now listen. The iron screw is back in detection again. The Mach 1 can also tell you how deep a target is. All right, we're gonna use this silver quarter to demonstrate how the depth indicator works. You'll find the depth indicator right there in the center of the screen. Now, one icon means it's two or less inches. Two icons means it's about four inches, and three icons means it's, much, it's deeper than four inches. Now, what I did there was take this silver quarter and moved it back. Started real close and then kept moving back. So the Mach 1 can detect a coin sized target deeper than six inches. Now I'm a good eight inches away there. Now the Mach 1 is equipped with an overload alarm. You'll hear the overload alarm and the overload icon will flash on the screen. When they put this piece of foil up real close to the Mach 1, It'll be, it'll be like a really big target. Don't worry, this won't harm the Mach 1. The Mach 1 is simply telling you that there's a very large target, or a highly conductive target. To continue detecting, simply raise your coil away from the target a little bit. The Mach 1 has three levels of adjustable sensitivity. High, medium, and low. Now the Mach 1 also has a battery status indicator, so you'll never be surprised with dead batteries when you're out hunting. The Mach 1 will operate for about 40 to 45 hours on 9 volt batteries. Now you can use rechargeable, just make sure that your rechargeable 9 volts are from a quality source. Well that's it for the Bounty Hunter Mach 1. Again, at the time of filming, this metal detector is selling for $75. I'll put a link down below so you can check the current price. If you have any comments or questions, put them down below in the comment sections. I answer all comments when it comes to metal detecting. If you really like this video, 
consider giving it a thumbs up and you'd really make my day if you subscribe to the channel. Until next time, good luck and be safe out there.